Mr. Gelman. He was like a hippie type and I got real weird and creative writing with him. And thank you for being an awesome teacher because I'm probably still creative because of you. Miss Fulton, one, because she was the one that told me I should do radio for a living. And two, because I was in love with her, I asked her to prom and she said no. Madame Gava Zamponti, she uh, taught me French, but also really liked food. So we were always eating in class and cook learning through that. That was a good one, Ms. Gava Zamponti. Um, my favorite teacher was my music teacher, but my, not my school music teacher, my after school music teacher. And it was because myself and three friends all do piano at the same time. And we had a piano bench with like a curtain sort of on it. And we would, each of us would hide underneath the piano bench during each other's lessons and like tickle each other's feet. And she knew that was going on and she was cool with it because pianists suck. I don't even remember who my favorite teacher is. I just remember I had this science teacher once who smoked a cigarette in class to prove that cigarettes increase your blood pressure. And at 16 years old, I thought that was pretty sick. My high school drama teacher, his name was Mr. Halpin. And he was my favorite because he he gave me a lot of opportunities, uh, like he gave me the lead role in my grade 12 high school musical, and it was amazing. And uh, he, I feel like he was like one of those tough love teachers, you know, like whiplash styles, but like not that intense, but very, very like tough love. Like you knew when he gave you a compliment, he meant it.